So a misplaced modifier is going to be where a describing word or phrase is not next to the word that it is supposed to be describing. And because of that, it creates a phrase to, in a sentence to be awkward or unclear. It makes it hard to understand. So let's look at a couple example sentences. Raymond awakened to a sky strewn with stars in his sleeping bag. So are the stars in his sleeping bag? No, Raymond is. He's in his sleeping bag when he wakes up and looks up at the sky. But the way it's written, the stars are what's in his sleeping bag. So we now need to move the phrase in his sleeping bag over next to Raymond awakened in his sleeping bag to a sky strewn with stars. Let's look at another example. Luke followed the elephant still wearing his pajamas. So who's wearing the pajamas? The elephant or Luke? And so this is the problem and we have to make sure that just simply to fix it, we move the phrase that is being describing, so the adjective or adverb phrase, next to the noun or verb that it is supposed to be describing. So since pajamas are not usually worn by elephants, but actually worn by humans, we need to move the still wearing his pajamas next to Luke. Luke, still wearing his pajamas, followed the elephant. Let's see if you can figure out the last sentence. Natalie handed the guitar to the girl that was missing a string. It should read, Natalie handed the guitar that was missing a string to the girl. Because girls usually are not missing strings. I hope this helps.